do subscribe to MJ Tube and hit on bell icon for latest videos. Hey guys, welcome back again. Today we will discuss some most important Android app for smart TV. So I will show you some uh, useful and productivity apps. So watch this video carefully. So first app is eShare. So this app will transfer your data from TV to phone, phone to TV, and you can also mirror your TV to phone, and you can also control your TV to phone. So for this, you need to download and install eShare in your smart TV as well as your phone. After this, connect it like this. And now you can easily mirror your smart TV screen on your phone like this. So I have given this video's detail information in my video description link. So all video which I'm showing here, I have given full detail in my video description link. So you can check one by one. So as you can see here, I am going to transfer my data from phone to TV. So these are very useful app to control and mirror your smart TV by using your smartphone. So it's the first app each year. Okay. The second app is, yeah, it's also very useful, useful for screen recorder users. So how to record TV screen? I have used many screen recorder to record my TV screen, but only one app will work like DU screen recorder. So I'm not sure it will work all the TVs, but it's work MI TV. So do you screen recorder for recording your screen. Next app is Vault. So you can hide your image, music, app, and data from your TV. So install the Vault in your TV and then import the, your data and set the password and boom. So you will hide your all data from your TV. So use the Vault. So I have given this video in my video description link, so check for more detail. Okay. So next app is a screen mirror. So you can mirror your phone screen to your TV. So you can use default uh, screen mirror app from your TV. If you don't have anyone, then you can use Miracast. So you can download this uh, application by Play Store or App Chat TV. So download the Miracast and open the Miracast app in your T uh, phone and then connect it and play your games on big screen. Okay, so next is very useful app, uh, like the app name is PC Remote Beta. You can mirror and control your laptop screen to your TV. So you need to download the PC Remote Beta in your laptop and then do the same to your smart TV. Okay, I have installed on the desktop and then I'm going to install the PC remote on my TV. After this, you can connect it by using IP address. So I have given full video in my video description link so you can watch and follow the instruction. So by using this, you can easily control your uh, PC on the TV. Okay, so next app is Smart Office. So if you want to open your office document like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, you need to uh, use the Office the Smart Office app. So it's, it's available in Play Store and App Chat TV. So download and install the Smart Office to open your document. Yeah, it's working fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So the next is Share It. Everyone knows uh, Share It work perfectly for your Android phone, but you can also use Share It to transfer data in between your smart TV or laptop. So install the Share It both in your PC and your smart TV, and you can easily transfer data from PC to your smart TV and smart TV to PC. So I have I I have already said you can get all the videos in my video description link for more details. Okay. Okay, so the next app is yeah, this app has, uh, this app also very useful. A uh, Wi-Fi file transfer. So you need to download the Wi-Fi file transfer APK file in your TV, and this is the easiest way to transfer data. Okay. So first, download the APK file and then install it on your TV and in your laptop. Just type the IP address and boom, you will get all data of TV in your laptop as you can see yeah okay so next very common 
uh, everyone know this like MX player so if you want to uh, download the subtitle or other things you can go with the MX player so MX player well known for best uh, media player so you can also use it for your smart TV like this okay so next app is TV clock so by default in many TV there is no uh, time and date will show on the screen but using a simple app you can show your time and date on the TV screen so install the TV clock like this okay and now you some permission and boom you will get date and time on your TV screen okay so next app is app locker so if you want to hide the app from your TV so you can use this app locker so remember the uh, application name and application symbol here what I'm saying, uh, showing here that only app will work on your TV so download and install the correct application so by using this app you can hide your TV apps like this so as I said I have given all this app link in my video description link so you can check it out so app lock for hide your app in your smart TV so next it set display so this app will allow to use your phone as a keyboard and mouse for this you need to download this display app in your TV and install it okay and allow this some permission like this okay done now download this display app to your phone and connect it with your TV and now you can use your Android phone as a PC mouse or keyboard look at that okay yeah so you can get all app in my video description link okay next is which is the best uh, browser I have tried many brother but in my point of view uh, the Safari brother is one of the best and fast working browser so I have used Dolphin Opera mini and Chrome Firefox okay all is working fine but in my personal opinion uh, Safari is little faster than other browser for smart TV so I'm using here right now the Opera and the Firefox okay I'm testing one by one okay so now the Safari so Safari a little bit uh, faster than other browser as you can see here okay yeah it's loading the page very fast as you can see okay good the next app I think everyone knows uh, like uh, ES file explorer this is the most common explorer for Android phone but you can also use this explorer for your smart TV so ES file explorer is work perfectly on any TV so you can use it for manage your data and application so the last app is if you don't have uh, Google Play Store or after TV app in your smart TV so then you need to download the APK file of after TV actually this is a, a Play Store like it will work as a Play Store so you can download the app from this application so you need to install this app to in your TV okay and after this you will get a lot of app on the after TV so I'm going to install the after TV okay allow the unknown sources okay install it so this is like a play store uh, you will get a lot of application in the after TV store like this so I have showed 15 application so let me know in comments 
uh, which application you like and which application is uh, new to you which is helpful to you so let me know in comments thank you for watching guys catch you next video please like share and subscribe thank you very much